Hi folks! Tonight we're going to cook a ham steak and I'm going to use salsa verde to cook it in a cast iron pan. So I'm going to start with a ham steak that I got from Giant. This is one and three quarter pounds. Nice steak. And we're going to take that out and dust it with some pan searing flour. And this is a very finely milled flour that is also seasoned with some white pepper and some salt. I'm going to use some olive oil just to get the pan ready and hot to accept the ham steak. And the real secret ingredient here is some Goya salsa verde. This is medium salsa. And I mean, you can make your own salsa verde if you'd like to, but this gives us a real head start on this meal. This contains some key ingredients. It has green tomatoes, jalapeno peppers, onion, coriander, salt, and this is a real flavorful salsa to add to a ham steak. A lot of times people only cook their ham with pineapple or gravy or you know some kind of sauce like that. This will really kick it up. So I'm going to start by taking the ham out of the package and I'm going to start heating up the pan and adding a little olive oil. All right, we we'll get a little olive oil in there. And then we're going to quickly take the ham and dust it with some pan searing flour. I'm going to lay the ham stick on the plate here with a little rim around it so that juices don't get all over the place. I'm going to take this pan searing flour and dust it on both sides. I'm just going to dust it and shake it off. Make sure it's covered. Anything extra will just shake off. And this uh, flour I use just to give a nice crispy edge to the ham. I think it's really going to be nice touch on this meat. Okay, so see how it's lightly dusted on each side? And we're going to put it in the hot pan. You can see the pan is already smoking. All right, nice. Now I'm going to sear this on both sides and then we'll add the salsa verde. Alright, let's flip this over. Get the other side to start browning. And as this is starting to sear on this side, we're going to add the Goya medium salsa verde. Now, I'm not going to be shy about this because I am going to turn the ham over and add some more to the other side. So let's just get the flavoring started here. Oh boy, this is going to be good. Yeah. Oh. Now the cast iron pan is a great way to cook a ham steak. And as you're finishing the cooking, the pan remains hot and keeps it ready to serve. While all the flavors are blending into the fibers of the ham. Nice. Right. Now that it starts to cook around the sides a little bit, I'm going to reduce the heat a little bit and turn this over. Alright, here we go. Alright. Now, I'm going to add a little bit more to the top, and we're going to let this simmer. All right, you can see by using uh, by using an ingredient like the prepared salsa verde, you save yourself a lot of steps. 
in making this dish. Now think about how you would like to serve this. We could serve it over rice, we could serve it with some sweet potatoes that are baked, or a nice baking potato. Lots of different ways. So get creative because the best ingredient is going to be so perfectly flavored with this salsa verde. All right, let's let this simmer for a little while. Oh, it smells so good. All right, we're going to let it simmer. Okay, now I'm going to transfer this over. Okay, we can we can carry over a lot more of this flavor with it, and then we also get the bits of flour that have cooked in the bottom of the pan with the pieces of ham. Okay, that's a nice piece of ham steak. Let's slice this open here. Take out a piece. We're just going to cut up a couple little pieces here. This is a nice one. Okay. Doesn't that look nice with the salsa on there? Let's take a taste. I know it's going to be hot, but I definitely want some extra salsa verde on this. Hmm. Oh my goodness, why haven't I ever tried this before? <laughs> if you like the taste of salsa verde, please try this recipe. Cook a ham steak in the cast iron pan and serve it up with some pinto beans and greens. Wow, delicious. Thanks for watching. Hope you get to give it a try.